Mexico Trail said a review had found that the Mosquito devices were not effective. Photo Getty Chris Green 14 hours Saturday, November 18, 2017. Sco Trail has banned the use of controversial anti loitering devices at train stations across the network after they were condemned by the Children's Commissioner. Scotland's National Rail Operator said it had undertaken a thorough review of the use of mosquito devices, which emit a high frequency normally only audible to under 25s, after concerns were raised earlier this year. These devices are a disproportionate and degrading approach that acts without discrimination. Bruce Adamson, Children's Commissioner The review found that mosquito devices, which were placed in three train stations around Scotland, were rarely used and did not help to reduce antisocial behaviour without other support. The devices were installed at Hamilton Central and Hellingsburg Central in response to reports of threatening behavior, with the aim of dispersing groups of youths who gathered at the stations. Over the summer the RMT union claimed that Hamilton Station was being turned into a war zone by gangs of headbangers and nutters who were compromising the safety of staff. Another device was also in place in Aberdeen Station, but has not been used since 2014. Condemnation in July Scotland's children's czar Bruce Adamson called for mosquito devices to be banned outright, pointing out that they have been criticized by the UN and other international human rights groups. The use of such devices is a breach of children's rights to go about their lives free from discrimination in a healthy and safe way when they use public transport, visit shops or meet their friends, he said. These devices are a disproportionate and degrading approach that acts without discrimination, causing discomfort to any children and young people who encounter them. Announcing the move, David Lister, Director of Safety and Sustainability at SCOTRAIL, said the safety and security of our staff and customers remains our priority, and we continue to work with all agencies, including the British Transport Police, Police Scotland, trade unions, and local authorities, to tackle any antisocial behaviour at our stations. These devices were always only a small part of a much wider effort to tackle antisocial behavior wherever it occurred. A small number of customers raised concerns. In 2010 a report by the Council of Europe said the devices should be made illegal under human rights laws, but the UK government declined to act, saying it was for individual councils to decide. Christina McKelvey, SNP MSP for Hamilton, Lark Holland Stonehouse, said she was pleased that Scotrail had listened to the concerns of local residents and welcomed the blanket ban. While tackling antisocial behavior is important, there are more proportionate responses than unfairly targeting one section of society, she added. I hope to meet with Hamilton Central to discuss these in the future. In news https.co.uk